All right, ladies and gentlemen, Jason Hitland, night number 10 is in the books for the team roping at the 2013 Wrangler National Finals Rodeo, and we have newly crowned champions, Jade Corkle, Clay Tryon. What an awesome, awesome year you guys have had. Yeah, it's been a good year. Um, Clay, you know, he's one of the, if not the best header in the world, and uh, I was just glad to get to rope with him. He's, uh, he's taught me a lot just about winning, and uh, I just try to follow his lead and do what he does. Yeah. Well, Clay, you know Jade's humble. Let's talk about your other partner. What do you think of him? Oh, he's good, as good as there is in the game. And, uh, you know, I was fortunate to get to rope with him this year. And, I mean, this was our goal all along when we started out, and it was just good to accomplish that. You know, right in round one, Jade had a scary moment and, you know, a lot of uncertainty. What was going through your mind as his partner when that happened and not knowing how severe that injury was? Well, I didn't at first, didn't know he got hurt. You know, sometimes you just get the coils pinched down on your hand and it stings for a while. And then he'd come out back in the tent and I could see he got him pretty good. But, you know, not really worried about him. I've done it to my hand. It hurts forever. But the thing I knew he'd bow up there, he ain't going to heal during this week anyway. So I know he'd get over it. I ain't worried about him much. I knew he'd come through. And like I said before, I'm just worried about what I got to do. And I know he's got me, got my back. Now, Jade, do you guys practice throughout the week earlier in the morning? Do you run the, the calves or? What do you guys do to practice while you're here in Vegas for 10 days? Uh, I usually don't go practice, but uh, this year after I did that, I went and Al Bach brought a smarty dummy out to the Horseman's Park and pulled it around for me. And then uh, I think I roped it two or three times just to, because I had to hold my reins different and my coils. So I was just trying to get a little bit more comfortable because it didn't feel very good. And then uh, Clay and I roped yesterday morning a little bit and uh, we roped at Charlie Horky's house. and. Uh, you just kind of have to, you know, if you get time during the day, go run a few. doesn't hurt, but uh, I usually don't practice when I'm out here. Now, has it sunk in that you're newly crowned world champs yet? Not yet. I mean, I've thought a lot about it, believe me. You know, and I've had some disappointments about over the last four years, of, you know, having a good shot just like I had tonight not getting it done. So it's more just glad it's over and satisfying. It, it'll sink in a couple of days, and I'll be really excited. And, you know, excited for our families, you know, my wife and kids and his family. They, they put a lot into it, too, and they're right behind us the whole way. So it's pretty cool for them. And my kids are already telling me tonight how they're going to celebrate if I win it, throw their hats and stuff like that. So it's pretty exciting just to, you know, that they're involved in what I do and excited for me. All right, ladies and gentlemen, Jason Hetland here at the 2013 Wrangler National Finals Rodeo and your newly crowned team roping champions, Clay Tryon, Jade Corkle.